you are looking at the Lerner Theater in downtown Elkhart, which underwent a two-year, $18 million renovation in early 2009. Now, the project encompasses two buildings. The Lerner Theater, uh, restored to its original luster and authentic in every detail, and the Crystal Ballroom, which was constructed from the ground up and designed to match the adjoining theater. Well, some 28,000 people come to Elkhart to work every day, but don't actually live in the city. City leaders are hoping to change that with the $300 million River District project. It's underway to create a walkable urban neighborhood of landscape, streets, stores, housing, and amenities like a major aquatic center. For more on the quality of place investments and the vision, let's turn now to River District Implementation Team Chair Dave Weaver and the team's private partner, Bob Deputy. And gentlemen, welcome to the program. Thank Thanks you. for being here. Let's talk about the River District uh, project um, because this really can be a transformational project uh, for Elkhart. How did it? How did it come about? How what sparked it? Yeah, we absolutely see this as, as generational transformation for Elkhart. Uh, what really sparked this? Uh, we get asked that question a lot of things, and there are about 30 items that, <laughs> but for these 30 items yeah. lining up, uh, the, the River District or the Aquatic Center wouldn't take place. But the Aquatic Center in Elkhart, fourth largest natatorium in the United States, uh, a huge private-public partnership between the Community Foundation, local leadership, the city, school system, and Beacon Health System. Mm -hmm. It's going to provide uh, absolute state-of-the-art fitness and Aquatic Center. Mm -hmm. Coming off the heels of that in regional cities, we saw an additional $70 million of redevelopment deployed in Elkhart, or, or um, yeah, de 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 deployed in Elkhart. And we thought it was important for us to tie a plan mm -hmm. around about $165 million of redevelopment. All right, let's talk about uh, the project itself. Big project, multi-use, uh, multi-dimensional project. Housing is a big uh, key there to keep, get some of those people to stay here. Talk about the project and some of the real highlights. Well, I think one of the highlights is you've already got some housing going up now. Uh, approximately, what, 370 uh, new units will are under construction right now. And then you've got a new supermarket that's starting to be uh, built. So those are a real plus. The whole area, the property's been acquired, so it will go out for bid for people who want to come in and build housing, residential, commercial, uh, even office facilities, and they've set standards so that this will be a very walkable, classy place and an aspirational place. People want to live, work, and play. A lot of communities around the state would like to do something like this, perhaps, but they don't, um, it doesn't get done. As we were talking off camera before, you said here in Elkhart, it became what a deal like, why not Elkhart? And the community kind of said, uh, it can be done here. Yeah, a absolutely. Um, Elkhart's a place that's known for its entrepreneurial spirit, mm -hmm. its spirit of getting things done. And luckily the stars aligned where a group was able to get together. The city was in a place where it was financially strong enough to invest $30 million in public infrastructure just in the river district. Mm -hmm. We have two rivers downtown. We have zero access to those rivers downtown. We have a river walk that's mm -hmm. disconnected. We're gonna make it contiguous a mile and a half around the river district put in walkable uh, streets. We're gonna bring all of the development up to those walkable streets, uh, connected pathways, take out the low head dam and actually activate the riverway uh, so that it can be used for recreational purposes. Uh, the city's in for a lot of money, private investments in for a lot. We're, we're here to do something transformational. We only have 20 seconds left, but you're going to send an RFP out uh, right very soon for uh, development around the Aquatic Center? In August, about 10 acres we've assembled around the Aquatic Center. We're looking for about 200, 300,000 square feet, feet of mixed-use residential commercial real estate development. Very good. Dave Weaver, Bob Deputy, thank you both very much. Exciting project here in Elkhart. I know we'll be following it in the weeks and months ahead. Thanks for having me. Thank very you. Much.